We're two days out from Hurricane Zeta. All the destruction from Dauphin Island and the Eastern Shore, it has to go somewhere, and we think we found it. As far as you can see, a massive mat of lumber, furniture, driftwood, just about anything you can imagine. Now on the beach on the north side of Fort Morgan. It shattered people's dreams. This certainly isn't what the beach usually looks like. On a normal day, uh, white sand all the way down the beach instead of trash. This is a favorite spot for Clint Striblin. I've been out here many, many years and this is the first time I've seen it like this. We've seen anywhere from children's toys to uh, people's clothes to wood, brand new wood that looks like it's just been bought to rebuild and it's out here. There's deck chairs, a baseball helmet, propane tanks and channel markers. It stretches as far as you can see and more is washing ashore. The beach may be carpeted with storm debris, but not even that is enough to stop Striblin and his buddies from doing a little fishing. Still catching fish, fish don't care what the beach looks like. So what happens now? Well, in the past, they have picked up the larger items, the public safety issues, and they'll also pick up a lot of the plastic, and there's plenty of that out here. But for the most part, this stuff will stay here and become part of the shoreline. On the Baldwin County Beat in Fort Morgan, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.